was splashing and sold to the game spitter. But the cash dog situation, you know, somebody's stealing 500000 worth of jewelry. You know, it's the same old trick, same old insurance scam. Ain't nobody really probably took a jury. It could be, but nine times out of ten, you know, this is what celebrities do, which is smart. Not they ain't knocking, ain't no knock on her. That's smart. She get tired of the jury, ready to switch it up, but don't want to come out of her pocket, don't want to go in her bank account and use some money she already earned. Yeah, you send somebody to break into the car, the insurance claim, you still got the jury. You just be patient. You probably sell the jury for a little less, a little cheaper. So you get free bands that way. And then when the money come back for the real jury, you know, you replace it and get some new jury without coming out of pocket. And you got some free bands. The same old trick, which is a smart move. And I can make videos like this, or YouTubers, and anybody can make a thousand videos about this. But they ain't going to stop her situation. They ain't going to stop her playing. Because in America, it's all about what you can prove. And when you got insurance on jury or whatever, it don't matter if you got tricks or somebody said they break it down. They know all this stuff. But, but if you follow the rules and go about the situation like how you're supposed to, follow the right protocol, ain't nothing nobody can do. They got to believe it. They got to give her the money. Understand that, man. So really with the jury that she going to keep alleged, you know, she can either sell it or hold on to it. Pay the dude off, give him about 10 bands, 15 bands, break into the car. Pay them off, or she could sell it if it's really worth five hundred thousand. She probably can sell it for about two hundred, three hundred thousand. Break that up. Might buy a car off that. Might buy a foreign off that car off that. Might buy some new jewelry for that. Might put down a new mansion. Buy a penthouse for that. You know, might invest in real estate with that. A lot of different situations she can do. Then when the real check from the real jury come, just replace the jury. Up the diamonds, get flawless diamonds, get baguettes, whatever, however. Whatever they rocking these days. And yeah, cash out, rock out, just like that. She ain't lose no which way. Just have a little bit of patience. And you know, just make sure you don't get caught up in no situation. And that's all good. And you keep doing it, you keep doing it. Next one she do, she got robbed at gunpoint. It's all different type of ways, man, you can scam in America. You got legit ways to scam, and you got illegal ways to scam. It's a lot of money in both of them, but the legit way is you don't get caught. You do it the right way and you get a big bag. And you don't got no worries. You ain't stressed about nothing. You ain't got to look over your shoulders on nothing. And that's what it is. Same thing with the file of bankruptcy. A lot of people think you broke. Nah, I just don't want to pay the money. File bankruptcy, close the LLC down, start up a new one. Build up business credit cards. Build up personal credit cards. Cash the credit cards out. Put it into another account. File bankruptcy, wait a year or two, start up, build it up again, get somebody to clean it or whatever, build it up again. That's the finesse. Understands a lot of legit ways. Just a lot of people don't know it. And they, don't, and they can hear it and still don't do it. Still don't even try. You know what I'm saying? Scared, don't want nothing bad to happen, lazy. A lot of different ways, a lot of different excuses people have come up with in their head for them not to do nothing. They'll, they'll want to do it, then they don't want to do it, and this just how you stuck not doing nothing. That's what it is in that situation, man. I hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, man. Go.